I got some deals today from Safeway. They were four 12 packs for $12.88. Diet Pepsi, NW Root Beer, Zero Sugar Mountain Dew, and Diet Coke. And then the um, eggs were $1.27 for 12. So got two of those. And if you bought buy one for $3.99 of the berries, any berries, you got two free. So they were all three of them came to $3.99 total. So this whole thing came to $19 and some change with tax. I think that's pretty good. That's how you save your money is get the good deals. Hey, I have a Walmart delivery for you today. It came to $143 and change. I just, I have um, a lot of the stuff already. This was just supposed to supplement what I have. A lot of this my kids asked for <laughs> that we were out of. Um, they didn't have any chicken patties, so uh, I just got chicken strips because they want to have, um, we call them Wendy's burgers. So it's a hamburger bun with chicken, mayonnaise, and lettuce. So I got two things of hamburger buns, these chicken strips, some Orita golden fries. These were a substitution for the fast food fries, um, Arby's seasoned curly fries and some Checkers Famous Season Fries that we were completely out of fries, my kids said. Well, I have a 17-year-old and a 20-year-old. Some fine green beans. I like to cook these with potatoes in the crock pot and bacon, bacon pieces. Some frozen blueberries. Some Sara Lee Delightful White Bread. Some sliced Italian bread. This is a really good deal for a dollar. This was a substitution. I ordered the Great Value, um, and they substituted for the Thomas's English muffins. I'm going to make little pizzas with that. So it would just be, you open them up, you can put hamburger on them, um, you can put pepperoni and cheese and sauce, and cook them in the oven or in the air fryer. My daughter wanted some more of these um, honey buns. I ordered the six pack of fritters and they gave me two four packs which is fine I mean two two packs which equals four I was almost out of adult multivitamins um, they don't have the four pack of the light Greek banana yogurt so I had to just get four individual ones which is fine um, applesauce strawberry flavored some Idaho potatoes a big thing of macaroni salad we like the double scooped potato salad, but it's like three more dollars than this macaroni salad, so I just got that. Unsweetened almond milk original. I haven't seen this at our um, Walmart before. The Taylor Farms Everything Chopped Kit. It says new. It's the same price as the other one, three fifty-six. I thought we'd try it. What does it say? Green leaf lettuce, shredded broccoli, cabbage, bagel, toast, green onions. We'll see if it's good. My daughter loves sour cream and onion chips. I think they're yucky. These are good though. These cheese it snapped. I bought some last week and they're gone. Got eight bananas. Three Roma tomatoes. These are huge. One green pepper. Two of their great value long grain and wild rice. This seems like it doesn't have enough moisture when you microwave it. So we just put like a teaspoon of water. We tear the top a little bit, put a teaspoon of water, and then microwave it. It's super good. This hot buffalo style tuna is delicious when you mix it with the macaroni from Trader Joe's or any macaroni, but we like to do that, my husband and I, for lunch. We love the hot, thick, and chunky salsa, especially my husband. My daughter loves the Nature's Bakery Fig Bar. She either likes the blueberry or the raspberry, so she said raspberry. I ordered the Great Value Sugar-Free Syrup, but they substituted for the Maple Grove. I really like this one too, so that's fine. I thought I'd try these Mott's No Sugar Added Applesauce Granny Smith. Might be a nice tart thing. Garlic Texas Toast. I thought I would make little pizzas with this. So. On the night with that English, we had to do the English muffins. I thought maybe we'd try a couple of those. So we were out of um, canned fruit. So I got two mandarin oranges in light syrup, four of the, no, two pineapple chunks, 
and two pineapple slices, the cans, two mixed vegetables, that's not a fruit, <laughs> four fruit cocktails. These were the cheapest ones, and these were a dollar a piece in 100% juice. So I got four of those. We we're almost out of black beans. To stretch the meat, since it's so expensive, I've been adding black beans and using half the amount of uh, turkey and hamburger. And some jumbo biscuits, because I like to make biscuits, gravy, eggs, and um, what else? Bacon or sausage. And then I got two ground turkey, 93%, and two of the 7327. This isn't my favorite hamburger, but it is so expensive right now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cook this ground beef, rinse it to get a lot of the fat out, and cook it with the ground turkey and mix it because it was super expensive. So my birthday's coming up. Decided if this would be the best way to do it. I got a Marie Calendar Spawn and Joy. That way we can just take our slices out and not um, eat cake for days and days. The high performance protein shakes. These are super good. I have a half of a one in my coffee in the morning with a little bit of sugar-free vanilla creamer. Delicious. So this came to $143. Did I miss anything? It sure doesn't go very far, but do the best you can. Try and eat from the pantry, and I'll show you my meal plan in a second. So this week's meal plan um, for January 31st through February 6th, I did um, a lot of soup because we're getting ready to go on a little trip in the next month and I didn't want to gain weight before we left because I'll probably gain weight when we're gone. So the for Monday, oatmeal, leftovers or canned soup and then for dinner, crock pot nacho grande soup. For uh, Tuesday, eggs and grits. I don't like grits so I'll have eggs and an English muffin probably or just eggs. Soup, leftover uh, soup from the night before and then for dinner seven can tortilla soup. That's super easy and I'm going to be really busy on Tuesday. Wednesday, pancakes uh, for lunch, leftover seven can tortilla soup, hamburger helper, corn, and salad. For Thursday, cereal, and then leftover soup from Monday and Tuesday, hopefully, and if not, we'll use canned soup. And then I've got some crock pot chicken meals downstairs I want to go through. And we'll look through there and decide which one sounds good. Friday, eggs and hash brown patty and leftover soup, hopefully there is, or leftover ch uh, crock pot chicken meal and English muffin pizzas. And then that Texas toast we're gonna try with the pizzas. And I also have um, mozzarella sticks, so we're gonna have a fun Friday night. That's it for this week, January 31st through February 6th. Have a good one, guys.